hi everyone welcome you all to deep matrix in today's video we see about what is second order system and what are the classification of second order system second order system is a system which has a denominator that contain two poles or we can also say that a system which has a denominator of quadratic equation with the highest degree of 2 the general form of second order transfer function is k into omega n square divided by s square plus 2 into omega n into zeta plus omega n square where omega n is a natural frequency and zeta is the damping ratio of the system we can also say that these are the two parameters which define the nature of the second order system here you can see this k which is the gain of the system on the basis of this damping ratio zeta we can classify second order system into four types they are undamped system critically damped system under damped system and over damped system so in order to explain you clearly about how the system works or what is the response of the system uh, we go through the simulations for that i declare the omega n value as 6 so we are going to apply those parameter value in the equation and run the simulation first under damped system here we need to apply zeta value equal to 0 so we'll go through this so in this formula i don't need this parameter i'm setting it to 0 because my zeta value is 0 so this whole term tends to 0 now we set this value to 36 36 and this value to 36 so we are ready to go this is the transfer function of the undamped system i am going to connect my step response step input to the transfer function and transfer function to So this is the response of the undamped second order system. Uh, it contains more of a sine like wave. You can visualize it more clearly if I run it for 10 minutes. So as you can see there are lots of sine waves. This is, uh, this is called a sustained oscillation because the oscillation is not vanishing or not enlarging. It is constant throughout the whole run so this is how a undamped oscillation looks like next we go for critically damped in critically damped system we have a zeta value as 1 so we'll change this so 2 into 6 into 12, 1 which is 12 so this is our critically damped system i'm going to run this So this is the step response of the critically damped system. As you can see, the system attains its steady state value uh, more faster compared to others. So you'll see this after running the remaining two systems. And also it is non-oscillatory um, because since it contains no oscillation in the output. So next we go for under damped system. For underdamped system, the uh, zeta value is lie between 0 and 1. Mm. So we will set it as 0 0.2. So 12 into 0 0.2. So this is the output response of the under damped system as you can see the response reaches its steady state value at 6 seconds before that we can see the oscillation which is uh, vanishing as the target approaches its steady state value and uh, this is how the under damped system response looks like next we go for over damped system i'm converting it to 24 So we are ready to run. So 
this response is more similar to critically damped system but the difference between uh, over damped and critically damped is uh, it actually uh, for example we, you can see the steady state the system attain the steady state value at second 5 so we will go for critically damped once again in order to show you the difference or wait one second let me replicate the transfer function block and step block and I spoke to so I am so here is my critically down So both the responses are more similar to one another but the only difference is the overdamped system attain the steady state value at the second of 5 but here the critically damped system attain the steady state value comparatively faster than the overdamped system because it attains at 3. So the response is faster in critically damped over over overdamped system. So that is what I would like to explain you in this video. Do subscribe our channel and comment about our videos so that we can improve the quality of our video. And also do check it out my website in the bio. I am also doing freelancing projects. Feel free to ping me. Thank you.